Christian, what do you remember about last year's playoff game, and how can it maybe be beneficial going into this one? Um, you know, I think obviously they're a great team, uh, really good defense. So for us, we'll have to go out there and execute and you know play each play. What are you laughing at, dude? I just to oh. shoot. <laughs> 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 um, no, but they, uh, you know, anytime you're playing a team like this, you got to come ready to go. And, uh, for us, it'll just be about executing. What, what made them such a challenge or makes them such a challenge? Well, they got a great pass rush. Um, they tackle well. They're great at forcing turnovers. So um, that's really all you can want on defense. So they, they play really well. They play hard. So once again, for us, it's just going to be about executing the play call. You would, uh, you would notes from the playoff from facing last year, Christian, and compare them. Say it again. Do you, do you look at your notes from last year when you're preparing to play them and just kind of do anything? No, I don't really do that with any team, though. You know, for for me, it's you know week to week, and each year is a new year. You know, um, obviously, you'll look at last year's tape and a little bit of it, and look at the games that they've had this year, and um, you know, take notes off of kind of everything, but. Um, Really, it's each, each week's a new week. I try to treat it that way. It seemed like there's a lot more room to run in the second half than the first. Is there anything in particular last year that, that worked better for you in the second half? That's a good question, man. You know, I think any time you look at a game uh, from the years past, uh, you know, maybe that'll be similar, maybe it won't be. Um, but I try not to go into games predicting anything. You know, you just you have your tracks, you have your reads, you know where to put your eyes. You know your assignment, and then after that, it's you know you just got to react and, and play extremely instinctually and, and go from there. Christian, where were you against the Cowboys? Where were you health wise last year? I yeah, I banged my calf up a little bit early, but you know good enough to finish the game. How much is a day off like yesterday? <laughs> I don't know. I, was, I don't know what the percentage would have been. Yeah. How much is a day off like yesterday? Those vet days that you get. How much does that rejuvenate your body? feel great yeah body feels great um you know i think even when you take the off day just all the trainers and the strength and conditioning coaches do a good job of keeping you uh, moving and keeping you in shape but at the same time just getting a little day off every once in a while you know feels great on your body is that newer here or do you did you get that also in carolina yeah i got it in carolina too Michael Parsons gets a lot of attention for the pass rush what, what about him as a run defender stands up to i think just you know Effort, you know, a guy plays really hard. You got a lot of respect for him and the way he, not just the way he rushes, but the way he plays the run, um, chasing down runs backside. Uh, he's an extremely talented player. Uh, he has such a good attitude. You know, he was um, he was doing all the things that uh, call it like grunt work. He was doing all that extremely fast and extremely well. You know, he was running off safeties full speed. He was blocking, he was making tough catches and obviously saw what he did in the preseason games, uh, which is kind of just a follow-up of what he was doing in practice. So it's been cool to see uh, him compete. And, you know, he's a, he's, a, he's a fighter and it's just, it's what you want in a, in a rookie receiver who's in that position. So uh, we're all proud of him and excited for him to continue to grow. All right. Thanks guys. Thank you. Thanks.